North Carolina is still finishing up their counting, but as it looks now, Trump's likely to win the state. Today, Decision Desk called the state a Trump victory, as well as a win for Republicans, since it looks like Republican Senator Tillis will hold on to his seat this year. NTD's Melina Weiskup has more election updates for us. A new projection by Decision Desk expects a Trump victory in North Carolina. The organization also projects Republican Senator Tom Tillis will be re-elected. Right now, Tillis has a little over a 1% lead. North Carolina officials have said they won't have final results until later this week. As it now stands, there are seven states that NTD has not yet called because of recounts or other legal disputes. Some of these states' results are within extremely small margins. Taking a look at three states with the closest margins. Georgia is in the middle of a recount right now. Biden has a narrow lead of 49.5% with Trump at 49.25%. Arizona has a lawsuit open now. And there's also a half percent margin between the candidates. Biden leading at 49.47% and Trump at 49.02%. And Pennsylvania also has both candidates at 49%. A larger margin there, with Biden at 49.76% and Trump at 49.9%. It's also another state where the Trump campaign has an open lawsuit. That means, along with Trump's newly expected win in North Carolina, if he manages to win over Georgia's 16 electoral votes, Arizona's 11, and Pennsylvania's 20, that would lead to 276 electoral votes for Trump. That's merely a projection based on the way things are looking in each of the uncalled states so far. Reporting by Melina Weiskup, NTD News.